In patients undergoing cholecystectomy, it is estimated that 5 to 20% have concomitant cholecystectomy lithiasis. Complications of cholecystectomy lithiasis include cholangitis or pancreatitis, and it is critical that timely intervention is taken to prevent these complications. This can be achieved by performing a cholecystectomy with pre- or post-operative ERCP or a single-stage procedure with cholecystectomy and common bile duct exploration. In this video, the latter will be shown as a treatment option. The patient is a 54-year-old woman presenting with jaundice and pain at the upper right quadrant. MRCP revealed multiple gallstones in the cystic duct, the common bile duct, as well as the hepatic duct. In addition, the cystic duct follows a posterior loop, joining the common bile duct on the posterior right side. Due to the size and amount of gallstones, as well as the complex anatomy of the cystic duct, a trans approach was elected for common bile duct exploration. Various techniques would be employed to retrieve the stones found in the biliary tract. After achieving the critical view of safety, the cystic artery will be divided between clips. An intraoperative ultrasound will then be used to confirm the location of the common bile duct, as well as the adjacent hepatic artery and portal vein. The cholecystectomy will be performed in a vertical manner parallel to the course of the common bile duct. This is done to avoid injuring the 3 and 9 o'clock vascular branches. Atraumatic graspers will be used to retrieve the stones. The laparoscopic suction tip can be used to position the stones towards the cholecystectomy in a process termed milking of the duct. For distal stones, a cholecystectomy equipped with a wire basket can be used for retrieval. The cystic duct will be opened proximally, and similar techniques will be used for stone retrieval. The cystic duct will be clipped with hemolock clips. The cholecystectomy will be closed, and the gallbladder will be removed between clips. Two Robinson drains will then be placed under the right lobe liver.